as and when life progressed and uh, you made various career changes and of course in education also you um, went first for to IIT then IIM and then went for UPSC and you thought about getting into the corporate world also so what was that uh, i mean moment like when you actually did you feel there is something life changing or i actually want to not be a part of the rat race and do something else i have never had uh, special moments there must be some lucky people somewhere out there for whom things get settled within moments for me the there have been processes continuity so i keep on sensing keep on engaging and then some particular moment probably a decision gets made but it's not the moment uh, the decision is coming from the decision is coming from a long process of introspection engagement questioning observation and uh, that's that's the way it is it would be quite fascinating if we had the good fortune of uh, of having important critical decisions emerge uh, with a snap like this you know wow as they say that eureka moment that that never happened with you even the eureka moment involved so much deliberation inner work hmm? one has to ask archimedes but what we remember is the moment mm-hmm. moment is nothing the moment could come now it could come two years hence it may never come at all what matters is the continuous inner work hmm? and from that sometimes those moments uh Uh, fructify uh, the moments really don't uh, count okay. so as we are speaking for example uh, some of uh, our friends here and those who are watching us live right now they are very interested in uh, in, in picking up quotations mm. okay. so they pick those up and uh, they they put them either on a poster or uh, note them down or somewhere many things happen with those those quotes now that quote cannot come if i do not speak for 2 hours i cannot just sit and start firing quotes but what people remember is the quote the quote is the moment that you are talking of yeah for that moment to come first of all there has to be two hours of work in fact nobody can understand that quotation if he or she has firstly not gone through the two hours of of the entire uh, discussion or lecture that's why quotations are so easy to misunderstand you do not know the context Mm-hmm. you just picked up one particular sentence that appealed to you yeah? so that's the thing with moments uh, we feel they are important but they are not so mm, it's summers we have mangoes there can be no mango without the entire tree and the tree takes long to come up but 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 the mangoes are are luscious and yellow and attractive hmm? it's the tree that matters it's the roots that matter um so i've never really counted the mangoes or kept a record of when they came and how many of them i've been engaged at the roots so but let me try asking you this way i mean what led to you as a person changing the trajectory of the path the journey you were taking i mean it's not a normal one which me or any of our friends sitting here would have taken so what led you to choose that path the difference between 
my trajectory my way of uh, my way of thinking or decision making and that of any other person was was no more than 2% 5% nothing it's just that when that 2% 5% difference is continuously maintained then it compounds probably to a great difference hmm? you could understand it this way the consistency and discipline you mean so so here you are hmm? going down a particular road now the road forks into two we often see that right mm -hmm. so one part go straight ahead and the the other one you, you just uh, tilt your steering by let's say 5 degrees and you keep tilting your uh, keep keep uh, your steering tilted by 5 degrees and within 2 minutes you find that you have turned 180 degrees mm -hmm. no so we think in terms of dramatic u turns we think that if you have to take a direction that's exactly opposite to somebody else's then it has to be a u turn huh that fellow is going this way and you just turn this way it doesn't have to be a u turn life doesn't operate that way things are subtler he is going this way and you just take a 5 degree that you maintain and then the ah uh, do you get this and and now it's very difficult to say when a particular turn was taken because it was always being taken always being taken hmm? and the difference is not much so it is never very spectacular or dramatic it never stands out as something especially obvious and therefore it can be missed mm -hmm. and therefore it can also be underappreciated you know because there is nothing dramatic you see when you when you look at the significant events of the past we we talked of the eureka moment we also uh, think of uh, of that that great buddha moment Hmm? the moment of enlightenment the moment of enlightenment first of all the moment of departure hmm? so he he sees the old man the sick man the dead man and he says i'm going we we remember the moment of enlightenment when the gods come to shower flowers on him but so much would have happened please think so much would have happened before that moment of departure and all that is quite mundane Huh? there is nothing especially colorful in that mm -hmm. so we don't want to remember that we think something very special happened in that moment when the buddha found the man dead or suffering mm -hmm. hmm? it's it's not uh, that way really uh, this this thing demands constant inner work like the mango tree you see huh? the mango tree has been working since so many years it's not it's only now that we are seeing that particular fruit but the work has been going on and when you look at a mango tree do you see anything very dramatic there something and very noticeable no nothing it's just a tree but the tree is at it hmm? so so that's that's the way